Hello, 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 hello. Kenny Evans here, another car video. The topic of this video is, are women only attracted to money? But as you know, before we get into that, I want to let you guys know again, as I do, uh, for the uh, majority of these videos from here on out, we, as a channel here, are for men and women being the best they could be in all aspects of their lives. Not just dating relationships, I know that's the main thing I talk about, but it's also the health, wealth, and the mindset. So, you know, that is what we're all about. Making sure we are all around good people and the best we could be, the best versions of ourselves. You know, so always keep that in mind. And here's seconds. Um, I know I got some new people here. Welcome. I know I got some uh, returning guests here. Welcome. Uh, for those of you new or returning who have not subscribed, hit the subscribe button and hit the notification button. And if you like my videos or if you just want to support me, hit the thumbs up button. I appreciate it. Any little like counts. So, now, let us get back to the topic at hand. Are women only attracted to money? And this is a pretty popular topic when it comes to dating relationships, just because it's like a lot of guys, especially in the red pill community, believe that is what it's all about. As long as you have money, women will come to you and they will do whatever you want. And, of course, you got the looks, money, status, and all that stuff. And, uh, ultimately, you know, uh, if you know, if you've been around my channel for a while, or if you know the way I think when it comes to dating relationships, you kind of know where I'm going to go with this video. Um, but I'm going to take a little twist, a little bit, and just really point out things uh, that money is really good for, what women look for when it comes to the money. And ultimately, uh, yeah, most women are not just interested in a man with money. Um, but first point I'm going to make here is gold diggers are. Gold diggers are interested only in a man's money because they see that man's money as a way of uh, getting what they don't have, you know, and um, where there's a come up. And that's all they, they, they're there for. You know, when it comes to the man's money, as long as he's willing to spend it on them, they will do what they got to do to get that money spent on them. But in general, most women are not interested only in a man's or attracted only to a man's money. But I will say, second point, women are um, interested or attracted to a man's money for the security. Obviously, if you are a woman, sure, you want to find a guy who's attractive, you know, physically or sexually. But ultimately, when it comes to that security and being able to pay your bills or have your bills paid, especially if she's not working, have those bills paid, not have to worry about money, have a roof over your head, have food, takes money so finding a man with money is good when it comes to the provider and the guy who is going to take care of the woman um, and her potential offspring you know if they are to have kids you know what i mean having money takes stress off it's just one less thing you have to take you have to worry about and and that security is, is pretty big, you know what I mean? So you have that security, you know you're good, you don't have to stress about it, you know, it's one less thing, and on top of that, you're able to free your mind and work on other areas of your life. But, again, uh, money is still not the most important thing, but it is good for security, and women always keep that in mind. But then that brings me to my third point. 
women do want men well let me repeat women let me say this let me repeat that again women want a man um with money for long-term relationships again that goes hand in hand with the security because if a woman sees a man as a provider or a guy who has a lot of money um but is not necessarily uh, a gold digger because she the guy didn't lead with the money you know he didn't she didn't know he had money until later but when she found out he has money or a stable job just some sort of uh, money uh, amount of money where money is not an issue she got excited because she's like wow I don't have to worry about money so if I was to have a uh, long-term relationship or have kids with this man she would know she does not have to worry about it she knew she didn't she wouldn't have to worry about it so that is the key women do look for long-term relationships with a man who have money because it's stability and security and they know that is one less thing they have to worry about and as we know it's not everything again I have to always say that money is not everything security is not everything because you see a lot of men and women who get divorced and the money or the man has a lot of money and the money's not an issue so it's not everything but it's just one less thing you have to worry about you got to always keep that in mind and even there brings me to my fourth point when you as a man lead with your money women will only want you for your money let me repeat that when you, as a man, lead with your money, women will only want you or be attracted to you for your money. So you, as a man, have to understand if you are getting girls who you feel are only interested in you for your money, it's because you let them know your money was the most important thing to you and you felt like that's the thing that they should like you most for. And you led with that and therefore they are most attracted to you for your money because you subconsciously told them that they should be. And you just can't be getting mad if you attract and go diggers or women who, who generally don't really care about you, but only what you can do for them. You know what I mean? So it is what it is. It's a part of the game. You just have to, you know. Get rid of that girl, or at least if you are with her, change things up. You may have to pull some of that money back, you know, and if she decides to leave, oh, well, she leaves. Now you learned a lesson that you should not be uh, leading with your money and actually, you know, uh, find women who aren't as interested in you for your money, which brings me to my fifth and final point. You must, as a man, win dealing with women approach the woman and lead with who you are as a man first and then the money later you know when it comes to approaching women if you do it right a woman shouldn't know how much money you have and she shouldn't even know that you have any money she should think you're just a regular guy she didn't she shouldn't think you're homeless i'm not saying be a homosexual or, you know what i mean and try to attract women as a homeless man, no. But you should just be natural and normal. She should like you for your personality, sure your looks, you know, um, you know your intelligence. She should like you for who you are, and not what you could give her or what she thinks you could give her. You know what I mean? But it's cool if she likes you after you've approached her. Y'all are cool, and you know, um, down the line maybe you take her on a fancy date or something. You know, if you're in a relationship or something and 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 then she kind of says, wow, this guy, not only is he a cool guy, but he has money too. Bam. That is what you want to do. Because again, leading with money will only get that woman attracted you because of your money and not because of who you are. So when she finds somebody else who she not only may be more attracted to, but has more money to, than you, she will leave you. You know what I mean? If things are not going well with you guys. So that is very important. You got to always realize you got to lead with who you are as a man and then the money later. And then you will have a much more solid relationship.
because then you know that woman is interested in you for who you are first and then the money second. Well, that is all I got for y'all today. Uh, let me know if you like my little list of, uh, you know, uh, women only being attracted to a man because of his money. Well, let me know whether you agree, disagree. Let me know if I missed something or what you would add to the list. Of course, like, comment, subscribe. Hit that notification button. And if you dislike the video, leave me a comment. Let me know how come you dislike the video so I can improve uh, this the videos and therefore the channel. Um, because ultimately, um, this channel is not just for me. It's for you guys as well. Um, and I want to be able to make this the best channel I can for you guys. Uh, but of course, um, let me know what other topics you want me to talk about. Again, not just dating relationships, health, wealth, mindset as well. Because again, this channel is for you guys and I want to help you guys be the best you can be in all areas of your life. You know, and of course, last but not least, I do appreciate donations. Any little bit counts. If you find value in the video, of course, only if you find value, you know, donate. I definitely appreciate it. And uh, yeah, that is it. Until next week, y'all stay safe. I'll see y'all then. And always remember, the strongest man is the happiest man. Peace.